Can you tell us your name? Uh, Lord Stubbs. You can call me Larry. Okay, Larry. What can you tell us about Ms. McCoy? Where do I start? I mean, Frank and I have known each other since middle school. So you guys used to be good friends? Used to be. You could say we were best friends. You used to be best friends? Well, I mean, we grew up together. We did a lot of things together, but he just didn't know when to stop. I mean, I was, we did everything, anytime, any place. But there's a time and a place for things, and Frank just went too far. Uh, and what's your name, sir? You can call me Snoop. Okay, Snoop. How do you know Mr. McCoy? He's a good dude. We've been neighbors for a while now. You related to Mr. McCoy? Yeah, that's not all for me. I'm Lexus. What can you tell us about him? I think he's the best. Really? All his problems? Doesn't that make you feel some kind of way? It doesn't bother me. I mean, it's his body. He can do whatever he wants with it. I mean, who am I to judge? What's your name, sir? My name is Ira Schlag. Schlag? Schlag. Is that Dutch? Fool, do I look Dutch? I don't fucking know, man. It's a black thing. You wouldn't fucking understand, would you? Uh, no, I wouldn't. Okay, I'm sorry. Dude. How do you know Mr. McCoy? M McCoy? That's my dude, man. He's a fucking genius. Genius, really? Yeah, fuck all that shit about his personal problems, man. He got fucking talent. Use your eyes. All right? So how did you meet Mr. McCoy? I want to get girls. To do that, I need a car. To do that, I need a license. And to do that, I need to know how to drive. And... Well, Frank, tell me how to drive. That's my first time through. So wait, taught you how to drive? Yeah, man. Yeah, me tell me how to drive. That's my first time. That's, that's unbelievable. Where are Frank is mine. When did you first examine this McCoy? Oh, oh, it's it's been a couple of years since I've seen Mr. McCoy. Have you ever seen anything like it? Well, upon my research with uh, Dr. Um, Linus Rucker, we found a couple of similar cases, but none quite as extreme. What do you think the cause could be? Well, excessive anything can be risky, I would say his daily habits are the core of the reason why he is the way he is. But did you know him when he was, you uh, know... Normal? Well, yeah. Uh, it's been that way for as long as I can remember. Does it ever cause you any problems? Nah, it's just been good with me. I don't know how he does it, man. All right? Answer all these fucking questions, man. What else you got to say to me, dog? Frank must seem like a really cool guy. The average person would let this get the best of them, but not him. I feel terrible. Why? Because I'm the one that showed him how to do it in the first place. To best explain how the situation happened, when you make a silly face, and your mom would say, you better not make silly faces or it's gonna get stuck. <laughs> Essentially, this is what has happened. I told him it could happen, but he didn't believe me. How do you think it's changed your life? True, we all have hurdles to get over, but you have such a positive outlook on things. 
Look, I know it may seem like he can't do everything like me and you, but he can. Oh, my Uncle Frank can cook. He loves to. Hey, yo, Frank's food ready? Okay, I see you. Hey, I still love his work. Not because he's all fucked up, but because it's fucking good. He's dope. You see this shit? You see this shit? My guy Frank did this shit this morning. What did I just tell you about this guy? He's a fucking genius. Look at him. Put the camera on him, man. There's this dude picking on this kid, and we went out there and handled it. But he went out there and handled it. I got the video right here. Checking out the artwork. What they do? Shit. My boy Frank ain't no punk. I'm putting this shit on World Star. Yes, y'all saw Frank when went up to my contest at Comic Clones. I mean, he, he killed it. Hey, man. He be having that fire, dog. You know what I'm talking about? That yeah. ganja. Yeah, we hang out. He be killing me at Madden. The fact that he can do any of these things is just beyond medical reasoning. Well, Miss McCoy, one of the guys told me you were actually really good at poker, too. Can you show me your best blank stare? I mean, really show me your best poker face? Wow. That is good. 